This is a story about a traveler from the west who visits an island in a penal colony to observe the local culture. The traveler is invited to watch an execution of a condemned man, which is hosted by an officer and a soldier. As the condemned man waits to die, the officer prepares the execution apparatus and begins explaining to the traveler how the machine works. The condemned individual lies down on a wool bed and sharp needles slowly cut through his body over the course of 12 hours. The officer also explains the penal colony's judicial process, whereby he is solely allowed to determine the guilt of an individual without a jury. However, as a new commandant has replaced the old commandant, the officer receives criticism of his methods and there is question as to whether execution by one man is the best method. The condemned man set to die is convicted of not listening to a superior officer and so will be put to death. The condemned man is strapped into the machine and begins to start the slow execution process. As the officer continues to explain the process of execution, the traveler begins to sense that the process is unjust, but feels that it is not for him to say. However, the officer senses the traveler's resistance against his methods and asks him to help him in convincing the current commandant that this process is necessary. The traveler refuses. Suddenly, the officer stops the machine and tells the condemned man that he is free to go. The condemned man is elated, celebrating that he has escaped death. The officer strips down and places himself in the machine. The machine starts up, but it begins to malfunction. The gears in the machine are broken and the needles puncture his body. He dies quickly. The soldier and condemned man take the traveler back to town. They visit a tea house and show the traveler a small grave dedicated to the old commandant. In the end, the soldier and condemned man escape detainment by the people in the tea house and as the traveler leaves the island, he refuses to let them on his boat. If this video was helpful, please share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. Don't forget to subscribe for more Minute Book Reports and thanks for watching.